she's a uh, a very special, uh, kind, um, very dynamic, uh, very professional, and yet a very loving mother. Lieutenant Florence B. Cho deployed to Afghanistan in the summer of 2008. Her mission, help create a health care system for the country's soldiers. She was passionate, yet emotionally torn, as it meant leaving her young daughter behind. And he says, good night, elephant. But along the way, Lieutenant Cho discovered something powerful, a way to connect, even a world away. I remember the first time she told me about United Through Reading. Uh, she was at a larger base where they had a program already in place. I didn't know about the program until until I got a phone call from her. I mean, it was just, it was so much excitement um, because she wanted, um, She wanted to be there for Kristen. We can go anywhere. Reading books on camera, Lieutenant Cho would then send the video and same books back home. Soon, little Kristen was waiting by the mailbox. Oh, she knew. It was, uh, it was a manila envelope. It had a little padding. Um, and she would, she would try to tear through them as fast as she could. She'd get very frustrated when we couldn't. Uh, She's a very savvy little girl. She knows to press the little button and stick the little DVD in there. Oh, what are they doing? She sent back books where she's reading and we'd follow along and and, uh, and she's there. We could feel her and, and she's growing with us, um, and which was the most important, which was the most important part. But in March of 2009, Lieutenant Cho's videos came to a sudden halt. Her words and life cut tragically short. The wife, mother, and champion of reading was shot and killed by an Afghan national soldier. It, it sounds kind of silly, but uh, we have uh, picnics here. Lieutenant Cho's gravesite is now a place where her husband and family members come to quite often. Kristen, now three years old, likes it here as well. I don't think she understands the permanence, um, but she certainly understands that uh, uh, that mommy is buried here. She loves to read. Uh, she can't quite write, but she tries to write. Of course, she loves to draw. So. Um, We'll bring mommy letters, uh, pictures. But the gorilla stole his keys. Today, these videos of a mom reading her only daughter a bedtime story from Afghanistan remain as part of Lieutenant Cho's lasting legacy. Besides the sounds, uh, her little characteristics, her little nuances, um, something I'll cherish uh, for the rest of my life and I know it's something that uh, Kristen will cherish for the rest of hers. While we'll never know all the great things Lieutenant Cho would have done as a leading supporter of United Through Reading, her message and mission are clear. It was her goal that everyone who's deployed have, has that opportunity uh, to share their story, to share that family time. Important time for those split by distance, but united through reading. I love you. I miss you. Mwah. See you later. Bye.